I hate creepers. I, I really hate creepers. Oh man. Hello again, Scriptbook here, and today in the Lines of Zanker episode 94, what are we doing? Well, I was all set to work on... That's not where I wanted to go. Uh, we'll, we'll fly there, that works. I was all set to work on the eastward road, and I've been working on clearing the path out and making it all nice and pretty. And it's going to have a really cool bridge across this gap right here. This is going to be really cool. Um, hello there, Parrot. Actually, yeah, you're a friend, aren't you? <gasps> yeah, that's right. I, I got another friend because the one died, so I got two friends. Uh, the one last week and this week. All right, so, uh, but then during the stream that we had on Zankar last week, <sighs> well, Steam came up with the idea that polished basalt would look good in my base. And I wasn't so sure, because look at this. I've got stone brick everywhere, dark prismarine everywhere some you know other forms of stone and i'm like yeah polished basalt why no and then and then this happened yep i put that right there and he was over here and he's like yeah that looks great and i'm like no and so i've been mining basalt because apparently polished basalt is gonna look good here so I think I'm going to have to work on doing that. Uh, and and I, I hate to admit it, but I think I think he's right. I think it does look good. I think it can look good in this whole place. So I'm not going to spend the entire episode working on that. But over the next few episodes, few months, you might notice some changes around here as... Uh, I might come through and add in some some changes. Yeah. All right. So, uh, where could we actually put this in? I mean, that, that, I'm not sure how that looks good, but maybe this would look good. Yeah, that would look better. All right. So, let's swap that back. All right. And like this and like that. And see, uh, he's right. It does look good. Oh, that's frustrating. There's so many different places. Like, you could have a strip going up there. And, oh, man, there's there's so many different places. All right. Um, I'll take a look around, change a little bit right now, and then we'll get working on that Eastwood Road. After running through the base quite a bit and going through quite a few stacks of this polished basalt, I, uh, I think I'm making some improvements. So I did a bunch of pillars in here, all the ones in between, the outlines, and then you may not have noticed, but I also switched these out. These were the chiseled stone brick, and now they are polished basalt. And I've got to say, I'm really liking this change. This is really good. Uh, it darkened it up a little bit in here, but it really, it really makes it pop now. Uh, and then over here, I've added it to the uh, what are these guys? The uh, the the smiths, the smithery over here. Now, I couldn't figure out a way to put it up in the chimneys and make it look good. So it's just going to be a little bit of a highlight around the bottom. And I think that works. And then, I don't know if you guys noticed that walking past, but I switched out all the chiseled bricks in each one of these towers. And it looks awesome. It really, really does. I like the way it looks going back in like that. And yeah, it took a little bit to do all of these eight pillars, but I think, I think it's a good choice. I'm glad I'm doing it, unfortunately. <laughs> but... I think it's going to make the base look better in the end. So, that is all I'm going to be doing with the polished basalt today. I'm thinking about maybe adding some to the towers later. Oh goodness. Oh boy. I'm going to I'm going to have to change those out. It's going to look so much better. Oh, that's going to be quite the challenge. All right. Um yeah. Ooh, I might, I might add it up there. That could look cool too. Although it, it mimics. No, I'll leave that alone. I'll leave that alone. But in there, that's definitely gonna be. Anyway, let's gather up our supplies. Um, yeah, I've, I've replaced a lot of chiseled brick here. Um, actually, you know what? <clears throat> I, ju I just realized that uh, I could, I could do these. I don't like it though. Good, good, good. I don't have to switch those out. Whew! All right, let's put that away. 
Goodness gracious, that could have that could have been a lot, lot more work. All right, let's put all of this away. And then I have my road building and my stones, my stone cutter. Let's take a quick nap, get the night to pass, and then we'll head east. Eastward ho, and we'll get this road going. First off, of course, we'll have to make this little bit of a bridge going across the river right here. Our river doesn't have a name. Do you guys feel like naming it? I think we need a name of our river here because it's kind of an important landmark in this area. Anyway, let's get working on this and then the long haul all the way out. Uh, not to the sea this time. No. To the north and to the west is the sea. To the east is a savanna. Yeah. But it's a small savanna and then sea. But yeah. All right. Let's, uh, let's get this a little bit done. The bridge is now in and it's time to work on the road heading east. Ah, this is going to be quite the road. So uh, let's let's do a quick time lapse of building the road. I'm going to do everything but the bridge in the middle. We'll come back and uh, do that together. It's going to be special, uh, a little bit different than this one, I'm sure. But uh, yeah, let's uh, let's let's do a quick time lapse. I hate creepers. I, I really hate creepers. Oh man. I don't know if you guys noticed it, but on that, uh, that little time lapse there, creeper had to come out of the woods and, well, out of the jungle. And uh, it blew up, which uh, isn't going to harm me. I'm wearing netherite. I'm all good. But uh, it blew up the one thing that I didn't have replaced before on me right then. That would be my, my stone cutter. Yeah. So I cut my time lapse short, went and got another one, had to get a bunch of more stone and stuff anyway. But now we are done with the main road part. Uh, this is the part where it goes over this little tiny opening. And I like that. Uh, yeah, I fought some mobs. Uh, I like how this looks. Yeah, another creeper there. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. And then we get to this point. And I only made this so that I could get this exactly lined up going across. So I'll have to take all of this out. Continuing over here. Can I? Thank you. We've got a little bit of a railing to the left there, and then right out here to the savanna. And this really is a tiny savanna. I mean, there's a desert and or ocean. It's yeah, it goes jungle to jungle. Anyway, so this part is all finished up, and now we just need to do the bridge. And the bridge, I don't know how I'm going to do the bridge. I'm not really sure if it's just going to be a nice slope. Yeah, I think that's probably going to look the best. If it's just a nice slope, it's probably going to look very similar to the other bridges. But um, actually, it would be really cool as if I made it out of glass. <gasps> that would be so cool. So instead of the, the stone, uh, the smooth stone slabs, it would be glass around that. Oh, boy. I'm liking this. All right. I'm going to go get some glass. I need to get some. I think I've got dark prismarine. All right. I'm going to go get that stuff and uh, we'll get it marked out and see if it looks any good. So I've put in the glass bridge and man, this is looking really nice. It, it, it just looks expensive. Like this is the best bridge that they built. And uh, now I just got to put in the supports. So of course, the supports are going to be the smooth stone slabs underneath the lights like so. And they're going to, of course, going to have to go all the way down to where they are hitting ground. So that's going to take quite a few. And then I'm trying to figure out what I want to do for going out. Because usually I've got the cobblestone. I don't want that. So I think I'm just going to keep going with the glass. And then go slab here. And then probably, what do we think? Maybe some smooth stone here. And then that'll be the railing. Yeah, that could work. That could work really nicely. Okay, I'm going to work on that and get this whole bridge put together. 
show it to you guys and probably end off the episode there. It is done. The bridge and the whole road headed towards the east is finished. And this thing looks absolutely amazing. I love it. It looks great. Um, actually, it's not done. I just remembered I haven't put the rails in. But that's not a big deal. I can do that at any point. Uh, but it is done. And yes, this thing turned out absolutely wonderful. So glad that uh, I, I thought of doing the glass. And this, this, this just looks absolutely amazing. And I'm so happy. Uh, but unfortunately, that is all the time I have for today. By next episode... Um, uh, uh, yeah, it's totally done. <laughs> Actually, that stuff is on me. My next episode, I'll have all of the uh, colored rails on it so that to anyone flying by will know exactly where they are. Let's just grab this and put this here and put this here. Um, and then go like that. There we go. So much better. All right. Um, that way, everyone who flies by will know where they are. And uh, yeah looking absolutely wonderful and if you guys enjoyed this episode please leave a like consider subscribing turn on those notifications you can follow me on twitter you can join my discord channel and i'll see you guys in the next lands of zankar until next time